What's up, you guys? Welcome or welcome back to West Fits, where I give my take on fashion, style, lifestyle with the emphasis of customizing clothes. My name is Wesley Lindsay. How you doing? Now, I'm a fashion guy here on YouTube, but that doesn't mean I know or understand everything. And today's a video I know it's not going to age well, and that's kind of the purpose. Today's video is going to be deep fashion things I just don't understand. And as somebody that has an appreciation for fashion and style and learning new things, always constantly growing in evolving but anyways let's just get into the video now like I said if we have any fashion heads in the in watching this video please give me some resources give me some information tell me why this is cool in your niche let me know like I said I'm open to learning understanding like where it's coming from so the first deep fashion thing I don't understand, I don't understand why you guys like it, is Rick Owens. I know, I know I'm starting this video off strong, and I know I have some Rick Owens diehard in the comments right now just roasting in my dumb ass, and that's okay, because I just understand the point of these shoes. I don't understand, like I know he does more than shoes, but when it comes to them shoes, they just look like fake converse to me. I don't understand why the boys and the girls be wearing like, we're paying a thousand plus dollars for some fake converse. I don't understand. I don't even like regular converse. So when you give me like these thousand dollar gone free seas type shoes, I am not here for it. Um, The next deep fashion thing I don't understand is Chrome Hearts. They're, it's a little bit gaudy. It's a bit gaudy to me. Like, I love accessorizing. I love silver, a light, deep metal. But I think it's a little bit corny. Like, I just, like, I don't understand the hype. Um, so if anybody can tell me <laughs> why the boys and the girls and Drake love Grandma Heart so much, I would love to know. The third thing I don't understand is kind of like a topic. It is the hate for fast fashion and thrifting. It's funny because when you're on fashion YouTube, you see, you'll see like these big long like video essays of like fast fashion is going to be the end of the world. But then if you go thrifting, they're like, oh, you're appropriating from poor people. I'm like, bitch, I got to wear clothes. <laughs> what? And as somebody that was like thrifting before, it was like, first of all, people have always been thrifting, but before it became like a really cool, like high fashion thing to do, like I was doing it back in 2010 when me and my friends were like, let's just go to the Goodwill and just see what we can find. Like, I don't understand like why people like hate people that are like thrifting, but also you're not allowed to have fast fashion. And it's like, I. And second of all, niggas are gonna buy clothes. Like honestly, if you think about it, like having an interest in clothes is kind of privileged anyway. So it's just the fact that y'all wanna like nitpick like who people buy and like, it's like you're not giving anybody anything else to do. Like, okay, I can't go to H&M. I can't order from Sheen. I can't buy from Fashion Nova, but I also can't go thrifting because they can't like, what? Leave people alone. Niggas just want to buy clothes. Fourth thing I don't understand is the designer clothes obsession. I've always said this. I don't think you're cool because you spend thousands of dollars on a t-shirt like Gucci, Fendi. Like they do some cute things. Prada. I mean, I like Prada. Like they, those shoes are cool. Like Prada does some cool things. But I will never think it's a flex for you to spend like thousands of dollars when I know like literally it costs them like $15 to manufacture. So, I mean, you're just playing yourself if you ask me. Next thing I don't understand is CDG, Comme des Garçons. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that right. The heart motif, okay. But like I said before, it's like people wearing checks with these hearts on there and then the prices go up like hundreds of dollars. I don't understand it. I don't know why people are into it. They don't even really look that cute if you ask me. I don't I don't know why people go for it, but hey, people do what they want with their money. If you know why these are cool, if y'all can link me to a video on why these things are cool, please do it down in the comments. And the last thing I will never be here for are those camel toe shoes. I know. 
I'm not going to walk around looking like a goat. Like, I might be the goat, okay? But I'm not going to walk around looking like a goat. Those shoes are just ugly. I don't know. I would just never be here for Kimoto shoes. Like, if you want it, if you want to have that moment, go for it. But I would never be here for it. Um, and honestly, they just look uncomfortable. But anyways, you guys, let me know what you guys think about um, some of these takes. Are there some fashion stuff that you don't quite understand? Let me know down in the comments below. Like I said, if you're like a fashion student or you're just somebody that has an appreciation for these things, let us know. Like, granted, I might not think the things these things are cool or cute. But if you have the knowledge, I, will, I mean, I don't mind getting some appreciation from them. Anyways, my name is Weston Lindsay here on West Fitz. So make sure you follow my Instagram at Zaya West where you can find all my latest customs that I handpaid myself. Then also make sure you follow my TikTok at West Fitz. Um, I've been posting them TikToks lately and them hoes been going up. So you want to join in on the fun and all the discussion and um, we're just going to keep growing and going here. We're almost at 100 subscribers and that's a really big milestone. We just hit our first four digit video. The other day, I'm really happy about that. So thanks you guys for all the support. I'm gonna keep doing this thing over here on Westfit. So y'all just keep watching, keep uh, liking the videos and keep sending them to friends. And we're just gonna keep doing our thing. Anyways, I love you guys. I appreciate you. See you for another video very soon. <laughs> Bye.